down and our schools are upside down. Education is in a crisis. It's a crisis of our generation. And because I've worked in the trenches, I know what to do to fix our schools. With a, a dropout rate of over 50%, we need to reduce the dropout rate. And secondly, we need to make sure that schools have a safe learning environment for every student. And you, you know, you've been to high school recently, some of you, and you know that there is a problem in some schools. And we also need to upgrade the curriculum, and we also need to bring mismanaged districts into compliance who are spending more money than they need. For Never too young to change the world. 1788, two young men came to the Constitutional Convention. Both had a plan, but one became the father of the United States. Okay. So, and, oh. They're concerned about education. You know, you want to hear what I'm going to do, but I'm also just as interested to hear from you. And as a teacher for over 30 years in public schools, a little bit in private schools, and quite a while in California Youth Authority, I've worked with every kind of student out there. And I really know the, the problems and what to do to fix it. And the reason I can say that is because I taught in the district that won the National Eli Broad Award for the most improved student scores in the nation. I could go on with more of that, but I think uh, also there are many things in the layering of the bureaucracy of the larger districts that uh, could be realized. Let me ask you a question. Yes. What is the, the dropout rate in California right now? It's around 50% and 60% in L.A. County. So it's about 50% statewide where kids don't even finish high school. And, uh, I know it's difficult. So we're here to help them, not to criticize them, and to share our experiences that will help them to improve. And if we can do things to bring the safe environment at the school issues, I try to focus on the common ground issues of what we can really do to improve education for our kids.